it's dead herrings we're here Hello. it's 1.7 update we're going to show you how to make pistons and show what is included in this update firstly we finally got into the update after notch's uh you know beard his way through making it for us and giving us quite a absolutely. few absolutely uh, so the first well. thing you need is a uh, boot shaped cobblestone there's a new texture uh, on cobblestone in this update which is lovely it looks much more smooth and then you need wood across the top then you need iron ingots we have 64 these are all legitimately acquired 64 in the center and then at the bottom center you need redstone and from there you can acquire pistons now something that toby's just lovely he's a lovely man is toby <laughs> uh he's shown me if you take pistons and then place them in your inventory crafting bench or a normal crafting bench and then you place slime on top you get sticky pistons or we'll create two of these and then we'll have two separately and we'll show you what to do with those in a minute one other thing important acquiring wool you now need to make a diagonal shape from the center to any of the corners like so to make shears and this means that you will get wool from sheep more so than uh, you would if you just killed them now they've changed it so if we uh, kill kill the sheep if we right click on the sheep with the shears on the hand we get three wool if I just killed it we would have only got one now you notice we've penned this sheep in Toby wants to demonstrate what you get if you kill a sheep these days it's <laughs> very ineffective he's an actually I'm just going on a, I, I'm going on a shearing rampage excellent oh you've got shears I see Sheary shear. Uh, so you get lots of wool if you use shears, and you don't if you don't. Now, also another thing that Notch, I think he's either implemented or going to implement, is that if you uh, attack them with the shears, then their wool will grow back quicker. Yeah, that would uh, be that would be beautiful because then you could yeah. uh, have sheep and keep them in a farm. Now another th also, another thing you can do with pistons. Uh, let's just show them what this piston thing does. Do you need to be thing. facing facing. The direction you want the piston to come towards you and then if you place a lever which you have handily two hand in your inventory next to it there you go. and then pull the lever so it cuts off the water flow like so so now you've got water That's... on tap which is awesome mm -hmm. makes a very good dam or uh you know trap perhaps yeah could be or... tr could be triggered by pre pre pressure plate we're not sure whether this works with lava yet we will try and test it and uh yeah we'll... true to form i'll probably fall in it yeah absolutely absolutely sooner or later would you like to show them what you can do with fences wink wink nudge, nudge. i would like to show them what we can do with fences well if we want to fence off this little area here mm -hmm. uh we do so but you know sometimes you just want to have more than one fence on top of each other and there you go wow this is how beforehand we used to have to do this uh Ra really rather annoying thing where you'd have to place your blocks up like this and then place the fence on top of it like so and then get rid of this one etc uh, etc et but now it's just a case of building them one on top of the other like that it really is a thing of beauty also what you can do is you can place torches on top of fence posts yeah Woohoo! Woo so now it looks like some kind of strange stick cake <laughs> so there you go as opposed to being uh, ungainly and stupid. What we want to show you with sticky pistons is that if you place uh, a piston like so, you get your handy lever next to it, and you get your wood block. If you then push the piston, it'll actually drag back. So the sticky slime from the slime monster actually holds on to the block. Whereas, if you wanted to use it with this piston, say, you could put the water here, so there's that stopping the water the dam is moved and then it retreats and the water goes through and there's no way of picking that up unless you slime the beast so there we go those are the things which have happened to this this, this means that you can do things like this as well yeah. uh, say for instance you have a hovering section like this and if you want to obviously this would be connected with redstone and thing but oh dear wrong heavens thing. let's get rid of that yep uh, what you can then do is, if you click the piston yeah. using a, a handy lever, which I have not, uh, so let's use a, a redstone torch instead. If you you pick them all up like that and then drop them, and then they've it dragged them back down. Absolutely fantastic. Which will be very good for building things like moving walkways or uh, you know sliding traps, etc. 
Now, just before we leave, we're going to show you something that we made earlier with the pistons mm -hmm. uh, and have had a hell of a time trying to actually use the pistons with. Um, we'll be uploading more videos throughout the day and hopefully sort of over the rest of the weekend all about the different sort of pistons, uh, the different ways that you can use pistons, uh, some of which we're extremely excited about. But here's one just to, as a sort of taster. Uh, obviously, you think it's a normal staircase, but then... Uh, Obviously, there's nothing at the top. Uh, the stairway stops, so you use your pistons in this way to then create a nice little stairway in and out, etc. It's just whoa! I almost fell through. How shocking! <laughs> uh, what we can also, what we also do, uh, obviously, because that looks rather ungainly, is we can press. We can do this where we have. It all covered up, and David, if you'd like to head up. Thank you very much. Oh, oh, this is this is fantastic. Look at that! Look at that! Wow. Yes, I'm at the top. Oh. Have it, has this one been disconnected? I don't think so. Try heading back down. Okay, let's go back down. Oh. Okay. I'm down. Yes, we've disconnected oh. that one. But this one seems not to be working. Ah, I remember why. It's because we haven't actually put the pistons in. Ah, <laughs> that would be why. <laughs> What's meant to happen is this. What's meant to happen is exactly that. So we will Watch. bring you a tutorial for this. And then at the bottom we have a nice bit of lava. Oh, oh. you're dying in it. Yeah. yeah. Oh. Yeah. Oh. Oh. It sucks to be me. It does. Never mind. Right, thank you very much for watching. We've been Dead Herrings. We'll be coming at you with more yep. tutorials of what to do with pistons later on. But for now, and ta -ta. Please subscribe for more. Yes, Goodbye. don't forget to subscribe. Subscribe! Subscribe. Goodbye.